Robots from all over our region are converging on the Amarillo Civic Center today. It's the first time ever for the first robotics challenge to be held here in Amarillo. KAMR Local 4's Maggie Glenn explains that is some good news tonight. We've got teams from all over Texas that are coming out here to play. 30 student teams from Texas and New Mexico are competing in Amarillo this weekend. So these robots, these kids only had six weeks to build these robots. The competition is put on by FIRST, or for inspiration and recognition of science and technology, promoting kids' involvement in the STEM fields. We have several design teams, so we go through a strategy period and we go through the handbook, and then we have a CAD team breakout, so we have different ideas coming together to create one robot. These are 120-pound robots, five feet tall, you know, footprint of a coffee table. Six weeks they have to design these robots to this game. The game changes every year. This year's theme, Deep Space. We, our robot has an elevator, so that's how we pick up the cargo and also the hatch panels, and then it'll lift up and put it where it needs to go in order to play the game. In the pit, it's three versus three, so the robots have to quickly form an alliance with two others they have not interacted with before, with the possibility of having to play defense against those same robots later in the tournament. I score points by, by closing off um, some of the, the holes in the game that, that represents an airlock, and then they put balls inside those airlocks. You know, to, to score the points at the end of the game, they climb up on platforms. And the games will continue tomorrow. There will be qualification matches beginning at 9.30 in the morning, followed by playoff matches at 1 in the afternoon, and finally, the awards ceremony at 4. The purpose behind the first robotics competitions is not only to encourage kids to get involved in the STEM fields, but also encourage them to stay in these fields for careers in the future. Live in studio, Maggie Glenn, KAMR Local 4 News. Jackie. Maggie, thank you. First offers around $80 million in scholarships to students involved in the robotics program. A women